given f maps x to 3x and g maps x to x squared minus 4. Find the composite function a fg, b gf, c g squared. So fx is 3x and gx is x squared minus 4. For a, we want to find composite function fg. So we write fgx here. Now gx is this, x squared minus 4. Next, function f. Function f equal 3x. But now the object is x squared minus 4 and not x. So we have 3 times x squared minus 4. B. We want to find the composite function gf. So we write gfx here. Now fx is this, 3x. Next, function g. Function g is x squared minus 4. But now the object is 3x and not x. So we have 3x squared minus 4 which is 9x squared minus 4. C. We want to find the composite function g squared. So we write g squared x here. Now gx is this, x squared minus 4. After that, this x squared minus 4 goes through function g again. Now the object is x squared minus 4 and not x. So we have x squared minus 4 squared minus 4 again. We expand it and we get x to the power of 4 minus 8x squared plus 12. Given f maps x to 2x minus 3 and ff maps x to ax plus b, find the values of a and b. We want to find the values of a and b in function ff. So we need to find function ff first. We have ffx then. fx is 2x minus 3. So we have f 2x minus 3. And this object of 2x minus 3 will undergo function f again. Now function f is 2x minus 3, but now the object is not x, it is 2x minus 3. So we have 2 times in the bracket 2x minus 3, then minus 3. And we get 4x minus 9. Comparing the 4x minus 9 and ax plus b, we can see that a is 4 and b is negative 9. 